Learning hotkeys is a great way to level up your skills in any software. So today we're going to learn Resolume's hotkeys so we can be faster and more efficient when working in Resolume. First, we can create a new composition with Control N. Or open an existing one with Control O. We can save our current composition with Control S or save as with Control Shift S to save a copy or alternate version with a different name. We can get to our composition settings with Control Shift C and open up Resolume Preferences with Control Comma. When we're finished, we can quit Resolume with Control Q. We can create decks, groups, layers, and columns in our composition with hotkeys too. Control K will make a new deck. Control G adds a group. Control L adds a new layer. And Control T adds a column. There are also a few hotkeys for working with clips. We can select all of the clips in the deck with Control A, copy them with Control C, and paste them with Control V. Alternatively, we can cut with Control X and paste again. And if we mess up along the way, we can undo with Control Z. And if we change our mind back, we can redo with Control Y. These are all pretty basic, you know, cut, copy, paste, those are in everything. But my favorite clip hotkey is Control Shift T. Control Shift T updates the thumbnail of the clip which can be great if you've added some effects to a clip and want to see that reflected in the thumbnail. For example, now I know that this is my blue version of this clip. But I also use this hotkey for creating labels inside my show file. Add the text block to a clip and create your label. Use Control Shift T to update the thumbnail and then delete the text block effect. This will give you a blank clip that doesn't affect your composition at all, but makes a nice, easy to read label that you can place anywhere you need to inside your composition. Hotkeys can also be used to manipulate your outputs. Control, Shift, and a number will activate that number display. And Control, Shift, D will disable outputs. This is especially useful if you accidentally sent your output to your main computer display like I just did. Control, Shift, A activates advanced output. and you can show the test card with Control shift l Control shift p takes a snapshot of the composition, which saves an image of the current state of your composition and inserts it as a clip. This could be useful if you have a state of your composition that you'd like to save as a still for some purpose, maybe a logo layout or a frame element or something like that. And lastly, there are some hotkeys for entering shortcut mapping modes. Control Shift K enters keyboard mapping. Control Shift M enters MIDI mapping. Control Shift O enters OSC mapping. And you guessed it, Control Shift X enters DMX mapping. Hitting any of them again will stop mapping. So you can hit M and M again to toggle in and out. And if you forget any of these keyboard shortcuts, you can find them next to their corresponding menu item 
inside Resolume. And if I forgot any, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Peace.